Hey, to connect your Xiaomi Smart Band 8 Pro into any Android smartphone, first of all, you have to turn on your device by using this gold pins and this charger. So you have to plug this gold pins right here in this place. There we go. And this second end of the cable, we have to plug into the charger, um, into the PC, or for example, into your phone, if you have this switcher. And now after a few seconds, you can find that the Mi logo will pop on the screen. And after this, you can just simply select the language. In my case, it's actually the English language. And now we have to download the Mi Fitness application on our device. So now I will have to go into my Android phone. I'm gonna get rid of this part. Now uh, we have to go into the Google Play Store on our smartphone. There we go. And uh, from this, click on the search and input the Mi Fitness phrase. We have to actually get this application from the Xiaomi. So in my case, I already have it, but I'm gonna actually uninstall and show you how to set it up step by step. So now we have to be also connected into the Wi-Fi or mobile data. And as you can see, after a few moments, we will be able to use this application on our Android smartphone. In this video, I'm, I'm using the Google Pixel 7 Pro, but it works the same for any other smartphone with the Google services. Now we have to wait for the installation process and we can finally open it. So click open, now tap start, accept this uh, agreement. And you don't have to select this one to enroll in the user experience program. You can just click agree. From this screen, you will have to select your region. So in my case, it's actually the Poland. Click next. And now we have to click into the device. And now we have to select add device. Then click agree to turn on the Bluetooth, accept the permission. Basically accept a very permission that is popping on your screen. There we go. And now as you can see, we can find the model of our Band 8 Pro. If for some reason you cannot find it, uh, you can simply swipe down, click on the system, and you can tap on the reset or reboot to power on your device one more time. And if for some reason you just cannot find it on your phone, you can try to click on the add mine model. And from this list, you will have to actually select the Redmi Band 8 Pro. So it actually appears just right here. And after this, when you select your device, you will have to actually sign in into the Xiaomi account. So we have to click on this orange button. And now from this, you can actually input your Xiaomi account if you have one. If you don't have account of the Xiaomi, you can just click create. Uh, but you can also use the Google account. So you will actually get the same account that you have login into your smartphone. So I'm gonna use this method. You have to click agree. Now from this, select the account that you want to use. And now select your Smart Band 8 Pro one more time. Okay, for some reason we've got this uh, connection issue. So let's click to try again. There we go. And now everything works. Click pair, click pair on your watch. And now you can just click start on your watch. There we go. And as you can see, uh, right now we can use our device. And on the smartphone to finish this connection, uh, all you have to do is just to click next, next, and done. Now we can turn on this notification synchronization. So click set, tap set one more time. From this screen, you will have to actually scroll down and select the Mi Fitness application and enable all notification access. Then click allow, then go back, go back one more time, click set one more time, click allow, accept another permissions. Uh, we can synchronize our smartphone with the do not disturb mode of our, smart, of our phone, so click set. And additionally, we can update software by clicking continue. But in my case, I'm gonna actually turn it off click OK for the synchronization. And now we are successfully connected. So that's all right now. Please subscribe to my channel and see you in the next one.